Hello and welcome back to Let's Talk by George. In today's video, we are going to review the latest update for Evolution X. That is right, our device have actually uh, received an unofficial update of Evolution X. Let me go to the settings page and go to the about phone section and try to find the um, Android version information. So as you can see, the Android version is 13. Evolution X version is 7.5. The, uh, the, the ROM is having 5th of January 2023 Android security update. And the default kernel that the ROM uses is Linux 4.19.261 and the build is by our friend Manish um, he actually uh, did a great job um, in making the ROM uh, smooth and stable so um, the ROM comes with default G apps and as you can see the ROM is not bloated with quite a lot of G apps you also get graphene OS camera and a default AOSP camera and as you can see, uh, the ROM doesn't come with the default Google Chrome, Google Chrome browser. So that is something that you have to uh, manually install it. So the kick settings is actually having the default uh, settings. There isn't any much uh, modifications on it. Now going to the settings page, as you can see, um, there are actually quite a few new customizations to the ROM, such as uh, there is a theme settings option and you can use um, a different background color for the theme and you can also select a custom theme color then you can actually uh, spot different uh, uh, kind of theme styles too then color source you can select a custom color source too then there is an addition of a lock screen clock font you can select a different lock screen clock font for your lock screen then you get nice uh, few choices of uh, new fonts and uh, yeah apart from that everything is actually um, the same that we used to get update for evolution x then status bar also there isn't much uh, change like uh, status bar like lyric option is present um, well there isn't any addition of new options or new settings to any of the um, customization so you can actually expect to have the default customization option in all the um, customization items uh, or customization options in this particular section so everything is by default and everything is actually the um, same too so as i've told you there isn't any addition to the customization options now under the battery you also uh, get to have the use pixel battery usage chart well that is actually the same kind of thing that we used to get and uh, the rom doesn't have any dirac or something like that so that is not added to the rom by the maintainer i believe and under the security you can expect to have face and fingerprint unlock and while going to the more security se section you can actually uh, see app lock um, the phone is not actually encrypted by default and finally going to the systems page under the gestures you can see system navigation you will get two button three button and uh, there is an option to hide the pill uh, hide ime button and stuff like that so um, pretty much i would say that the rom is quite stable or the rom is uh, really uh, stable and i do really love the smoothness of the rom and there is also actually UOX launcher and this launcher has all the customization like we used to get for the uh, Duff first and all so basically you can expect uh, the same kind of customization um, customization from the launcher part 2 and there is actually a uh, game space also if you are a gaming enthusiast definitely you can make use of it once again, I would like to thank you uh, for watching my ROM review video and also the maintainer of this particular ROM. He did an amazing job in uh, compiling a beautiful ROM for us. Thank you.